What's up guys, Grizzly Wizard here, coming back for another reaction to The Legend of Vox Machina, Season 3, official trailer. Uh, slash intro, right? This is going to be the intro of the next season. I'm looking forward to this. I'm finally all the way caught up on Season 2. Really enjoyed the ending, actually. I'll be talking about that soon. I know the reaction hasn't quite come out yet. Either way, I'm really enjoying my journey through The Legend of Vox Machina. For frame of reference, I haven't seen any of Critical Role, um, and my only context is Vox Machina, the show itself. Um, I'm having a great time with it. I think it has a tremendous amount of heart. And even though not all of the jokes land for me necessarily, I still think it's really good. Um, and I'm excited to see what happens next. So without further ado, Legend of Vox Machina, Season 3 intro, let's go. Oh, new, new theme intro, okay. The score is different. I mean, it's an arrangement, but still. Ah, uh, the matron. Percy's done with guns. Fucking Ripley. How is she doing this? <laughs> Killet's going away on her Aramente. Scanlan's daughter or whatever. Yes. Ed Grog has the gauntlets now. Oh, let's go. This is going to be so much fun. Yay, all the side characters. <laughs> Holy shit, Pike! Yes! Thordak! Oh no. The Raven Feathers, what could it mean? <laughs> oh, that was that was fun. That got me hyped. No, I can't wait. I like that I like that it's essentially the same theme song, but they've retooled it, like it's it's a new arrangement for it. The the animation looked a lot cleaner. Like maybe it's maybe it's just because I'm watching this in 4K and I and I wasn't streaming it that way before, but like yeah, I feel like they've stepped it up a little bit animation wise as well. Man, this show is great. This current storyline, um, they've, they've created a problem for themselves in that the bad guys are too cool. And they did that in season one, too. Like, the, the Briarwoods, I was definitely rooting for the Briarwoods. They were just, they were really compelling, and they were awesome. And now we've got the Chroma Conclave, all right? We've got a bunch of chromatic dragons that are just, like, trying to take over the world. And I'm not supposed to root for that? Like, come on, man. Dragons are badass. I mean, like, Thordak, such a cool character. And the fact that he's voiced by Lance Reddick, like... Get out of here. Come on. You're telling me that instead of rooting for a bunch of fucking chromatic dragons, I'm supposed to be rooting for Scanlan? Really? <laughs> I can't wait to see what happens, but honestly, I kind of want the dragons to win, just because, I don't know, anyone that's been watching my channel for a long time knows that I am very much pro-dragon supremacy, all right? Just makes sense. It's the natural order of things. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait. Season 3 is going to be awesome. I'm going to be reacting to every episode right here on the channel. You can stay tuned for those. The full links will be up on Patreon, like, immediately. I don't know if we know if they're going to be released in three-episode arcs the way that they were historically, as, as I've read about, because, you know, I wasn't around back then, but that's what I've been told. Um, or if we're getting individual episode drops. Either way, I can't wait. Either way, I can't wait to see where the story takes me. So, um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my reaction to The Legend of Vox Machina Season 3 trailer slash intro. We'll just, we're just going to call it both. Check out the rest of the channel for all of my Vox Machina reactions. They are all posted in a playlist, and I'll catch you in the next one.